Hi everybody and welcome back to my channel. My name is Brie if you're new and if you're back then welcome back. Um, I do all kinds of videos so I do hope you guys choose to like and subscribe to my channel. I do lots of things based on Disney, Harry Potter and also lifestyle, fashion and beauty related videos. So if you are interested, please click that like and subscribe button. Alright you guys, so let's just get into this video. Today's video is actually going to be my February and January favorites. So it's just going to be a mesh of things that I just loved throughout these two months of the year. And I am using my rose gold ears just because I thought it was cute and it matched one of the items I wanted to show you guys. So if you guys are interested, then definitely stick along. Alright guys, so let's just get into it. So the first thing I do want to show you guys is this spirit jersey from Shop Disney Store. I'm going to stand up and show you guys. So let me show you guys. Alright you guys, so it is just this cropped, um, what's it called? Spirit jersey. But in the back, it says Royal Crush. And it's part of the Oh My Disney collection and it has all the princes on the sides of the arms. It's so adorable. I just can't. I just had to pick it up. It was on sale too um, at the Disney store. So I just grabbed it. I loved the color. Yeah, so I just really loved the color. And it was a deal. They were having some kind of sale on the Prince's merch. And I just thought it would look super cute. And I loved the cropped style of it. Because I think I can use my leggings and my vans. My checkered pink vans. And I can just totally cute with my rose gold ears and I just thought it was cute so I will link the price and the links of everything that I show you guys down below all right you guys so next two clothing items that I do want to show you guys are these two I'll show you this one first this is my jeans jacket that I bought from the Disney store as well it is a Minnie Mouse jeans jacket there's some pins of her over here and it says Minnie Mouse Club I just put my Targaryen um, pin on here because I love Targaryen from Game of Thrones, but that's a whole nother video. And in the back, it says, I'm a member of the Minnie Mouse Club. And I just thought this was the cutest jeans jacket. I tried it on in the store and I loved it. And I just love the kind of play on the Mickey Mouse Club with the Minnie Mouse Club because I would totally be part of the Minnie Mouse Club. And I love this jacket. So I will leave the links to this down below as well. All right, you guys, last clothing item I do want to show you guys is this shirt. I have it uh, matched with one of my um, camisoles in them inside, but this is, sorry, not a shirt. This is my, uh, like, a suede jacket, like a moto jacket, and I got this from Charlotte Russe. They're having their liquidation sales at the mall. I mentioned in my last video, I am wearing the same outfit because I'm trying to film a lot of videos today, so just excuse that, but I got this jacket and it's so beautiful it's like a full suede inside is like full satin and you guys this was like seven dollars it was like 65 percent off or something like that and there was an extra sale because the liquidation sale was the last one this is a size extra small but it looks beautiful and i think it's perfect for springtime and yeah i've been using it a lot lately and you guys, this whatever material this is, it it keeps my perfumes smell in there for days. So super good deal. I don't know if they're having online sales, but I will link this below as well if I can. All right, guys. So two bags I did pick up recently that I wanted to show you guys are one is Disney and one is actually from Victoria's Secrets, but they're both like my favorite colors, the baby pink. So you guys, this is from Victoria's Secret and I did get like a huge discount on this because I had like, you know, their coupons that they send out and then their semi-annual sale or whatever. And you guys, this is a mini backpack and I think it's very like Gucci-esque in a way. And the straps are super thin. It has chains on the bottom and it's super cute and it fits a lot of stuff. I have stuff in here already, but... I love it and it's super cute for like park days or just everyday casual wear and stuff and it's also very chic too without like breaking the bank so I love it and I'll link this below. Okay guys, second backpack I do want to show you guys. I don't know if you guys noticed already but I have a thing for mini backpacks. But this is a Disney Princess mini backpack from Loungefly. It's actually from Hot Topic. 
and one of my subscribers and one of my old Pila sisters um, sent me, DM'd me this and she's like, oh my god, girl, this like looks like you. I just wanted to share. Da -da -da -da, and Hot Taco was having a sale for it too online at that time. So I was telling myself like, oh, I don't need another backpack, all that kind of stuff. But I did go into the store and I found it and I walked around the mall a little bit and then I decided to come back and get it because I was going to regret it because it's such a me backpack. And I'll show you guys a close up. So there is a Disney castle over there. It's a cute like quilted um, material and there's a little princess crowns on the side and a Disney D. The back just looks like that. So you guys, this is actually a really cute backpack because there are actually sides too. You can put stuff in. And I think it's perfect for when we go to Disney again. And just, you know, again, casual, everyday kind of wear. So you guys, just sticking with the Disney theme, I did want to show you guys some things, collector's items that I did decide to jump on the bandwagon with. And they're part of the Disney Wisdom Collection. So I'll link the website if you guys want to check that out down below. It explains everything, but they're basically inspirational quotes from different movies each month. Has a different quote and theme and character. So last year they had the Mickey Memories and this year they have the Disney Wisdom. And I decided that I would pick up the journals. So I'm going to show you guys the two journals I picked up. So January's journal was actually a quote from Dumbo. And it is, the very things that held you down are going to carry you up, up, and up by Timothy Mouse. So super cute journal on the side, it actually has a series number and everything. And on the inside, I'm actually using it a lot, but it has Dumbo on a corner and then Timothy Mouse on the side. And then on the inside, it has this cute print. So I figure that I can use this like as journal keeping, list making, memory keeping, all in one per month. But I am a little bit behind because I decided to jump on a bad wagon kind of late. But um, it's super cute because you can put them together and I figure I can like show them to my kids one day and they can, you know, see what was happening this year for their mom. So yeah, and then this one is this February one. This is actually Mulan themed, well, Mushu themed. And it is, the quote is, the flower that blooms in adversity is the most rare and beautiful of all by the emperor. So super cute. This one does have Mulan and Mushu in it. And then the inside looks like this. So yeah, I'm super stoked on my journals. If you guys know me, you know I love stationery, so so excited. Alright guys, so my favorite perfumes I've been reaching for the most of these couple months are actually these right here. And I'm gonna mention this one first. This is the Flower Bomb, Nectar, Victor, and Rolf Rollerball. I explain all of this below in my other videos, so I'll link it, but I love this one so much. And other ones are my Coco Mademoiselle and my KKW Crystal Gardenia fragrance, the original. So these are the three that I have been reaching for the most. It has been kind of turning into spring now. It's still cooler weather, but I love that soapy, fresh floral for like the springtime. So I've been, you know, totally gravitating towards my florals. Okay guys, so I'm gonna get into some skincare, makeup, and like body products and stuff for my last couple products. So I'm gonna show you guys this one first. This is by the brand Bliss and it's it's called That's Incredipeel. It's a spa strength glycolic resurfacing pad to smooth and brighten. So I did pick this up from Target. I believe we had like a free sample of this in my hum nutrition box. And it's basically a dupe for like the Dr. Dennis Gross Alpha Beta Peels that I am obsessed with and they changed my skin forever. So I wanted to try this out, at least give it the 15 days and see if it gives me the same results as the Dr. Dennis Gross ones. And if they do, I'm gonna switch over because they're like a third of the price. It is 15 in here, but the Dr. Dennis Gross, I believe has either 30 or 60, and it's like 80 or 90 bucks. So I don't know, I have to do the math. I'll do it for you and I'll show you guys what's more worth it. But if this works, I might just switch over to this one and I have been loving it so far. So again, you guys, I think this was 20 bucks. I'll link this below. This is the Bliss That's Incredipeel. Okay guys, so next is a makeup palette and this is Anastasia Beverly Hills Sultry Palette. 
So I picked this up from Nordstrom. I had my eye on this palette for so long. It like glitters so beautifully. And I don't know, I just always, I know there's that huge warm tone trend going around. Um, I love warm tones, but I feel like my heart is very cool tones. I don't know if that sounds bad or what, but I promise you I'm, a, I'm an amazing, sweet person. Um, but I love these, this palette. It's beautiful. The colors are pretty. I'll show you guys a close up. Okay guys, so here's the colors. So it is a neutral palette, but it's more cool toned, very chocolatey, like dark chocolate. There's a pop of pink in there, like a peach. And there's also some gray, like smoky tones. And I love this pearl tone right here for like the inner corner. So beautiful. Yeah, you guys, so I really love this palette. I think it was totally worth it. Um, I forget how much it was, but I'll definitely link the price below from Nordstrom. And I believe they sell this also at Ulta and Sephora, I believe, but I love it. It's been out for a while, but I just decided to pick it up now. I don't know, I just love it. And I am starting to declutter my eyeshadow palette, so I'm gonna pick out like my favorites and the rest I'm either gonna um, give to people or just throw them out because I don't use some of them. So yeah, you guys, this is the Sultry palette from Anastasia Beverly Hills. All right, you guys, so I just wanted to throw these in here because I have been loving them and I wanted to review them for you guys. So this one is the Redken Diamond Oil Glow Dry uh, Shampoo. Yeah, it's for Shine Enhancing Glow Dries and it's from Redken. And I mentioned this before in my Ulta haul and I wanted to try it. It's supposed to really help like the shine and the smoothness of your hair. I have used this for the past months or so and I love it so much. It literally changed my hair. It's smooth like all the time, super shiny. And I don't know if this could be in conjunction with like my Hum Nutrition hair vitamins and just my um, like bi-monthly or you know every few months I go get my keratin treatments as well for my hair but my hair has been feeling so healthy lately and I'm so thankful and this is definitely a part of it. So yeah you guys this is the Redken Diamond Oil Glow Dry Shampoo. And this you guys I picked up from Bath & Body Works. This is their Rose. Shea and Vitamin E Shower Gel. It's new for spring and it's basically a mix of rose water, jasmine petals, and creamy musk. And I love Bath & Body Works um, in general, but I really love their shower gels. It smells amazing if you love roses. They're perfect for the springtime. And ugh, if you love musk and rose together, you will love this. So definitely pick this up if you want. You have a whole rose water line so it's definitely right up my alley and lastly you guys I did want to go second to the last I did want to show you guys my home nutrition vitamins um, this is my second month going on using these vitamins I do have the daily cleanse the flatter me and the red carpet Ooh, backwards but I love them and my skin since I've been using this has been so good I've barely broken out like ever I don't think I've broken out once since I started using these and I barely get bloated anymore. If I do get bloated, it goes away right away once I take my pills. And my hair and skin have been amazing. So I definitely rec recommend these pills, these um, vitamin supplements. I will link their um, link down below to check them out. I do have a discount code. It's not like an affiliate code or anything. It's just... Um, like a discount $10 off your first order and then when you guys do that I get $10 off my order as well so it's like a win-win situation and I definitely recommend these I can't recommend them enough and I'll link my other video explaining these down below as well okay guys so last thing I did want to show well actually I'll show you guys one more thing after this but this is my TARDIS I've had this for a while it's a TARDIS lip paint by Tarte and this is in the shade Festival and it's like a mauve pink nude and I've been using this for a while but I really have been loving this for the springtime like late winter spring so I would definitely link this below it's perfect for every day all right guys and lastly I just wanted to showcase my Gucci Mormont uh, small leather bag I love it so much I've been using it a lot every single day and it's beautiful. I will link my video below where I kind of explain, you know, I showcase my bag. But I'm so happy about it. I love her so much. And she matches everything. It makes everything super classy. 
All right, guys, so that's all I have for you folks today. Thank you again for watching and tuning in. I appreciate your support so much, and I hope you guys choose to like and subscribe if you haven't already, and I can't wait to see you guys in my next one. Bye, guys.